Welcome to Collectible Motor Car of Atlanta. My name is Chris, and today I've got a beautiful 1972 Chevrolet Camaro Z28 Resto Mod. But before we get to that, I want to bring up that we just got some new merch in. We got some awesome shirts in to say Collectible Motor Car with our brand right on the front, 100% cotton, awesome shirts. I actually wore one this weekend. Nice and cool to wear, nice thin, but quality material. We also have some nice handbags that we are selling as well. And if you buy a car from us, you'll get one of those free. But let's go ahead and get started with this beautiful Camaro. This has been a frame up restoration on this beautiful 72 Camaro. And this Camaro has been a Southern car its whole life. It spent most of its life in Georgia up to the point that the gentleman that brought us the car bought it in Tennessee. He has owned the car for about a year and has done a couple little touches to it, such as do a full paint correction on this beautiful paint job here, put a tilt column in it, new steering wheel, gauges, brand new clutch, couple other little things that he did to add his little touches to this car as well. But overall, guys, this car is fantastic. Some of the nicest paint that I've seen on a car in a while. It's got a beautiful pearl white stripe here on the front of the hood. And this paint is a beautiful like metallic candy burgundy color. I don't even know what color it is, but it's just absolutely beautiful. But as you can see here, you've got your Z28 split bumper grill here. Everything is in great condition. Your headlights look nice here. All your chrome looks brand new on this car. All your body line gaps are nice and even on this car. Whoever did the paint and body work on this car did an excellent job and definitely knew what they were doing when they were putting the car together. As we look down the fender here, I don't see any kind of imperfections, no chips, no scratches. Your Z28 emblem is right here on the side of the fender, as well as some 17 inch billet specialty wheels. Those are some killer wheels and they look awesome on this car. You do have disc brakes up front as well. Go ahead and notice your gaps here on your door. I would touch this beautiful paint to show you that it is flush, but it is so beautiful, I do not want to touch it. You have your beautiful mirrors here that are painted in the same color as the car. All your chrome trim around the windows, your drip rail, and everything on here is in excellent condition. It looks very, very nice. Even your chrome door handle here looks to be brand new. Check out your gap here on the back of the door, nice and even all the way down. Your body line lines up with the body line on the door as well. Overall, just a very, very high quality car here. I know I keep saying that, but this car just, I don't know if it does it any justice on video because it's just such an awesome car. You've got another 17 inch deep dish staggered wheel back here, billet specialty with rear disc brakes. So that is an upgrade for this car. Awesome upgrade. Also, the front does have coilovers on it. You do get coilovers up front as well. You still have the leaf springs out back, but overall, super nice, good quality rod. Got your marker light here, looks to be brand new. All your chrome back here on the back, on the back looks really, really nice. You've got the circle tail lights here out back as well, and they're in great condition. I just love the Z28 spoiler on the back here, just gives it a really aggressive look. Before we move to the next part of the video, I do wanna go over some of the paperwork that this car has. It's got a full folder of receipts and manuals and books and everything that's been done to this car. We went through here adding up and we got up close to 50 grand in receipts and just quit adding. Uh, but overall, just a fantastic car. Um, I did want to show the trunk as well, show you how nice and neat the trunk is on this car. You do have two sets of keys. Be very careful here, I don't want to scratch the paint. One really cool feature is the gentleman added a really cool trunk shock here versus the bow system that you have or whatever they call that that lifts up the trunk. He added this to it, which is really nice. You hit the key, you turn it, give it a little bit of pressure, it shoots right up. Take a look at the paintwork underneath here on the bottom of your trunk lid, just very high quality. You can tell that this car was done correctly. Even look at your drip rails here on the trunk. They're all nice and clean and got a lot, a lot of gloss to them just like the rest of the car. The trunk is nice and clean. This car has no rust on it. That's one benefit to it being a Southern car its whole life, especially being in Georgia, we don't get a lot of salt on the roads or any snow. So a lot of our cars are rust free down here. But overall, just a fantastic car, guys. But with that being said, let's go ahead and check out the 350 engine underneath the hood. All right, guys, check out this super clean engine bay here. You've got some upgrades like long tube headers, some upgraded valve covers. You have a newer vintage AC system that blows ice cold, four wheel disc brakes, a four barrel quadrajet carburetor, but overall just super clean under here and very, very nice. Uh, I definitely like the look at this engine bay. It's definitely a very timeless look, which meaning that it will stay in style for a long time to come. Overall, just very, very beautiful. But let's go ahead and check out this beautiful interior that this car has to show us. 
Guys, all I can say is, wow, this car is just as beautiful in the interior as it is the exterior. You got nice black leather interior in here, brand new carpet, Hurst four-speed shifter. You got a Camaro central steering wheel with leather, just a super nice, nice steering wheel. You've got a tilt column here with some nice chrome uh, tilt lever here and turn signal indicator. You've got Dakota digital gauges to give you all the parameters of what that 350 is doing. You've got an upgraded stereo there as well. But guys, overall, this car looks brand new on the inside and it is just absolutely beautiful. I don't even see any imperfections. The cracks or the dash is not cracked. The mirror looks in great condition. All your glass looks brand new. Just overall, beautiful, beautiful interior. But guys, overall, that's all I really had to say about this awesome interior. Let's go ahead and get this one on the road and go for a test drive. All right, guys, we're out cruising in this beautiful 72 Camaro on this beautiful Georgia day. We've got the AC blasting in here and it just feels amazing. This beautiful steering wheel just feels amazing in your hands when you're driving it. The coilovers up front keep you nice and planted on the ground as you're going around turns. The shifter shifts amazing on this car. Just an awesome car, very well put together. You can definitely tell someone took the time to do all the fit and finishes on this car to make it a great driver. Go ahead and give it a little gas here. You got that four speed transmission. It cruises very nicely in fourth gear. We're running about 60 miles an hour and I'm in at about 1800 RPMs, which isn't too terrible. Um, but overall, just a really nice car. It drives really well, it tracks nice and straight down the road. And what I really like about it is the steering is still really nice and tight. A lot of times on these old cars, you get that sloppy steering. This car does not have it. I mean, it moves as soon as you move the steering wheel the car moves it's definitely got a very sporty feel to it but overall just an amazing car like i said earlier the ac's blowing ice cold we got the windows up on this hot georgia day and we're just out here cruising on highway 41 and this car is just a blast to drive we actually got people giving us a thumbs up as we drive by because um, this car just looks amazing as you're driving down the road but with that being said let's get back to the shop and let's put this one up on the lift all right, guys, we got the Camaro up on the lift. We'll start up front here. You got your oil pan, your long tube headers. You do have coilovers on here. They're QA1 adjustable coilovers to give you that perfect ride height. And man, this thing just drives really nice too, especially to be as low as it is. Still has an excellent ride quality. We'll work our way back here. You do have your four speed transmission. You got your dual exhaust that runs into an X pipe here. It's tucked nice and tight to the car so that it does not drag the ground. As we work our way to the back here, you do still have your leaf spring set up. And the way it is lowered out back here with some, with, is with some blocks, as you can see there, that will uh, give you the um, stance that you want. You do have a sway bar out back here as well. New rear diff cover. You've got a newer fuel tank as well. But guys, overall, this car is in good condition, especially to be all original underneath here and not been fully restored. This car would greatly benefit from a dry ice blasting. If you, you guys out there that are wanting to take this car to the next level, you could come under here and dry ice blast it and it would look fantastic. We've looked at a couple of places where we've wiped some of the dirt away and you can still see the original color underneath there. So this would be a great candidate for that. But for you guys that just want a nice driver, super, super nice car to take to cruise ins and car shows, this is definitely your car. You can cruise in style with the AC blast and it's just an, an amazing experience driving this car. It's a definite attention getter as well. But guys, if you're interested in this car, give us a call at 770-738-7111. You can go to our website at collectiblemotor.com and you can find this car on our website and view all the specs and all the pictures that we have on this beautiful Camaro. But till then, we'll catch you on the next one.